So if you have a Toyota and the track off light comes on and the check engine light comes on both at the same time, I thought I'd go over the causes of this and how you could go about fixing it. And so first of all, the first thing to know is that when there's an engine problem, Toyotas will turn off the traction control system. And so there might not be a problem with the traction control, but the engine is having some kind of problem. And when that happens, Toyota vehicles will turn off the traction control. And so because of this, the only real way to know what's going on with the vehicle is to read any error codes that might be on the vehicle's computer. And this is really easy to do. Every vehicle built after 1996 has what's called an OBD2 port up and underneath the driver's side dashboard. And you basically just plug in a scan tool into one of these and say read codes. It's really that easy. There's a lot of low cost OBD2 scan tools, some as low as like $20, $30. I'll put a link down below if you need one. You can also go to any automotive stores. They quite commonly will come out and scan for any error codes for free. Be sure to call around first, but places like AutoZone or O'Reilly's or things like this, they usually will come out and scan for any error codes for free. But the first thing to do is to read any error codes that might be on the computer. For example, if you get an error code like P0441, it'll be an evaporative emission system incorrect purge flow. That'll point to a problem inside the EVAP system. And when you get that error code, it could be as simple as a gas cap. It could also be something else, but a very common problem with that error code is a bad gas cap. Another example is if you got a C0210 code, which would be a right rear wheel speed sensor signal malfunction. And if you got this error code, then very likely that speed sensor simply needs to be replaced. And so for this reason, the first thing to do when you have a track off light and the engine light is on at the same time is to get a hold of an OBD2 scan tool and scan the onboard computer for any codes because this will point you to what the problem is. Like I said, there's a lot of low cost OBD2 scan tools available, but if you can't get a hold of one, go around to automotive stores and they quite commonly will come out and scan the codes for free and tell you what they are. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give an overview of how you go about fixing a Toyota with the track off light on and the check engine light is on at the same time. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.